to go out tonight to visit several motels here in Springfield. I'm going to go out and reach these women out here that are lost and hurting at this time. You know, we're very honored and uh, just feel very honored to be able to go out and do this. I'm going to go out and, and see if we can't help some of these women get off the street. We go out into the streets and, and reach those that are lost, people that are hungry to hear the word of Christ. We are going out tonight to evangelize at the hotels and out on the street to reach women that are um, in sex trafficking. And uh, we, we're going out to pray with them women and hopefully to bring them to Christ. We just played with a woman that's getting ready to take a trip to Texas. She was alone up in the hotel room there and she just said that us coming there made her feel so much better and that we just brought the love of Christ into her atmosphere there. So it was just really uplifting. So for me, this outreach is very personal um, because it wasn't so long ago that I actually was strung out living in motels in North Springfield. Um, I was just lucky enough to be reached by someone in this church before I was trafficked. I got to witness firsthand the power of God moving in some women's lives. It, it, was, it was incredible. Tonight, what I've seen going on tonight was, was a powerful thing. I've seen many of the women that the women were praying with breaking down with tears of hope, joy. You could see something different move. I just felt the Lord's presence so strongly that I was able to share that there was hope and know that there was because I'm experiencing it myself. Um, we prayed with some women, um, invited them to church, and really saw that um, we gave them hope. So. It was just a very exciting experience, and um, just praise the Lord. Um, I had a wonderful experience tonight as I watched our ladies at uh, Freedom City reach out into a, a hotel room where I know that I know that I know the man was in charge because as, as he held the door open, he said, keep my door open. And there were several ladies in there. And I got to see our ladies pray for one of the women and her break down and just go from not wanting anything really to do, just taking a card to, to walking forward with the lady and just being held in the greatest hug and, and breaking down and then walking into the room and crying and that brought out another lady who received a, a card information and a rose and it was it was beautiful, and I just know God. God did his thing tonight, and it was beautiful.